Hello and welcome back to the world of psychology. The next big topic that we will discuss will be the power of touch. So how strong are we influenced if somebody touches our arm or our shoulder? Does this make any difference for our behavior? And I think we will cover quite a lot of interesting studies, like for example a study in which a server touched customers on their arm. The researchers wanted to know would she get a higher tip. In another study, scientists tried to find out whether touching a woman on her arm improves your chances to get her phone number. But today, to dive into this topic, I want to present to you a study by French scientists in which they try to find out whether compliance could be improved by handshaking. So they sent out 20 year old confederates to go from door to door and to ask for a donation. The confederates always said, well, hello, um, we are collecting money for the Hope for Madagascar Association. Would you spend one euro to help children in Madagascar? When they introduced themselves with a handshake, almost everybody was willing to give one euro. Whereas in the control condition, when, when they did not use the handshake, um, only about 50% were willing to give a little donation. So quite an interesting study with only one big weakness. They only had 37 participants. In science it's not necessarily a big problem if you have a small number of participants as long as you have a big effect. And in this study they had a huge effect. But nevertheless it turned out over the years that especially those studies with a small number of participants sometimes are hard to replicate. So if you are studying psychology and you are still looking for a topic for your math master thesis or your bachelor thesis, well, I think this study would be very interesting to replicate. And if you should do so, please send me an email. I'll be very curious whether these results can be replicated. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this episode and if you want, we will see you next time.